Hey everybody, welcome back in. It's another edition of the Doug Russell Television Show right here on SportsRadio1250.com. Hope everybody had a great 4th of July weekend. It's the end of Summerfest. We're back to the grind. It's uh, pretty much five-day work weeks for me and Wicket. I know, everybody's going boo-hoo for one reason or another. I'm not sure if it's good or bad for pretty much the rest of the summer. But I did have a chance this weekend to, yes, I know we've been talking about it, to actually be a minister and perform a wedding ceremony up in Minocqua for Paul and Christine. And it was a very nice ceremony. Thank you very much. And uh, it was pretty much everything that you had hoped that it would be, and I didn't screw anything up. So, hey, there were a lot of kids in the wedding party, and Paul's ring almost slipped through the cracks of the deck that you kind of see below there. But regardless, pulled it off without a hitch. It is legal. It is final. It is done. Paul and Christine are husband and wife, and uh, I just wanted to, more, l less Paul, more Christine, thank her for trusting me with her day. Had a fun time doing it. And again, if you want me to do your wedding ceremony, um, I will do it. All you have to do is contact me. Contact me on Facebook, contact me via email, call the show, whatever. I'm not that hard to get a hold of. You know how to get a hold of me by now, I would like to think. Also, from this weekend, something that I missed while I was up in Minocqua, Ryan Braun opening his mouth and saying that the Brewers need to go out and get specifically a starting pitcher to help them through the second half of the season. I didn't have any problem with it because Ryan Braun, make no mistake about it, is one of the very few leaders on this Brewers team. You take a look at Prince Fielder, you take a look at Mike Cameron, Trevor Hoffman, and Ryan Braun. Those are the team leaders. You can throw Craig Council in there as well because he's been around the block a couple of times and has a couple of championship rings as well. But these are the leaders on this team. And if Ryan Braun, who's got another seven years on his contract or six and a half years left on his contract, if he's going to be in Milwaukee for the long haul and show the excellence on the field that he's been showing, you want him to be a vocal leader. It's almost damned if you do and damned if you don't because we criticize guys like Braun when they don't tell us anything in interviews. They talk in the 12-second cliched statements that you hear all too often. So when they actually do say something, then we're going to go out and criticize them. I don't think so. I don't play that game. And um, I don't have a problem with anything that Ryan Braun said because he's not telling Doug Melvin anything that he doesn't already know. That'll about do it for this edition of the Doug Russell Television Show. We'll be back at it tomorrow morning starting at 5 on the Doug and Mike Show, cooked up by George Webb Restaurant starting at 5 a.m. right here on SportsRadio1250.com and on the radio, AM 1250 WSSP. See ya. Doug Russell Show. Doug Russell Show. Doug Russell Show.